What's going on, y'all? I'm Lamb, the Real Estate Insider. Today, we're looking at the home of someone that's trending right now. He's been trending for a week or so. Um, it's Bishop Lamar Whitehead, which is interesting. My name is Lamar, but his name is spelled L-A-M-O-R. Mine's L-A-M-A-R, but pronounced the same way, I presume. Bishop Lamar Whitehead of Brooklyn, New York. Um, well, his church is in Brooklyn, New York, but his home is in New Jersey, and I found it. Yes, I found his home. Well, you know, if you have been watching the news, you notice his church was robbed during service. He was supposed to get on the ground um, by these robbers, and um, supposedly hundreds of thousands of dollars of, I think, four hundred, five hundred thousand dollars worth of jewelry was taken from him and his wife, and, and I guess others in the church. And he's known to be a flashy preacher, as you can see right here with the attire. He's known to be very flashy and all. I mean, that which doesn't mean he should be robbed, of course. But he is known to be flashy. And they seemed to, he said they came straight for him, so they knew who he was, knew what he had, and knew they were going to come up off of what he had on his body, on his person. He didn't have any security there for some odd reason. I'm not sure about, about that. So there's a lot of questions to be asked. But let's, this is a real estate channel. Let's get to the house, right? So basically, I found that he has a house in New Jersey. Um, before I show you that house, if you would hit the thumbs up button, subscribe if you haven't, join if you want exclusive content. And right after this intro, I'm going to show you his house in New Jersey. Okay, so this is the home of Bishop Lamar Whitehead. Now, just a few facts about this house. The house has six bedrooms, seven bathrooms, spans over 6,200 square feet. It's located in New Jersey, Paramus, New Jersey. Now, he moved into this home, or he purchased his home in uh, February of 2019 in his own name, Lamar Whitehead. I'm looking at the records right here. He purchased it in his own name for $1.64 million, all right? Uh, in August of 21, August of 2021, he sold it to himself. I guess, what is it called? A deed switch? I'm not sure what you call it. Quick claim? I don't know. Quick deed? He deeded it to, he deeded it to him, his own company, Lamar White Head Inc. So he deeded it from him, his own name to, he transferred the deed to Lamar Whitehead Inc., in August of 2021, and then in May of 2022, just a month or so ago, he deeded it back to his own name, both for $10 transaction, $10 transaction, I guess you can do that, all right? So now it's back in his name and not in the name of his LLC or business or whatever he has. But take a look at this house. Let me know what you think about it. We're going to rate it at the end. We're going to provide our insider rating uh, and enjoy the tour.
So what'd you think of the Bishop's home, his lovely abode in New Jersey? Of course, this may not be his furniture in there, but this is the bones of the home. At least you're able to see 6,200 square feet of space. $1.6 million home is valued at about over $2 million now, according to Zillow. I also saw that he has a couple of brownstones in Brooklyn as well. I'm not sure if he still owns them, but he at least at some point still owned a couple of brownstones in Jersey. I mean, in uh, Brooklyn. So it's time to rate this home on a scale from 1 to 10. One being awful, 10 being amazing. What do you give this home? What do you rate it? Just based on the bones. If I had to rate this home, I would give it a 6.5 rating. I didn't love it. I mean, it was all right. I like the size of it. I like the size like that. It's open, but it was kind of an older style to me. It was built in what, in 2014, I believe? Let me see when it was built. It was built in 2014. Okay, 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 okay. It was, it's okay. Sit on two acres. The exterior is nice. Kind of reminiscent of Bishop Marvin Sapp's house, which is on this channel as well. You should go check that out if you haven't looked at it. Anybody you can think of house is on this channel. So don't just look at this video. Go check out some other videos on the channel as well. And also hit the thumbs up and the, and the like button. And also comment and let me know what you rate this home on a scale from 1 to 10. All right. I think that's all. I think that's it. I think we're done. I'm Lamb, the Real Estate Insider. Until next time, peace out.